Okay, hello all. I wanted to make this clip to thank my new subscribers and to answer some of the questions that are coming across my comment sections. Uh, one of which is frequently, what am I using to catch this footage that I film? Right here in this opening clip, you're seeing me do a fake alignment with my telescope so that I can track the moon. Um, normally you'd use two stars or a polar alignment. What I'm doing here is marking out the cardinal points and I will roughly aim my scope just off south which will allow me to track well enough and as you can see I mislabeled two of the directions here but that's okay I knew which direction I was looking. Um, the hologram clip has brought up a lot of controversy and I would point out the leading theory is that I filmed it off of a monitor. Monitors or most monitors are 72 dpi resolution. My clips are high definition so if I was to take my clips and film them off a 72 dpi monitor you would notice the resolution drop now if you compare the hologram to all my other clips they all look pretty much the same you can test this at home film something off a monitor and you'll see what i'm saying if it's an old monitor yeah you'll see lines but it, just test it you'll see um, people are interested in the camera that i'm using so basically i have a canon rebel t2i and I remove the lenses I'm doing here. I put a T adapter with no eyepiece. This is to increase my field of view so that I can get most of the moon in one screen and increase my odds of seeing something. What I'm doing here is putting a light filter. This knocks down city light or man-made light. Um, as for uh, the hologram clip, you know, one of my big pet peeves is fakery and lies. I'm so against it, I can't even overstate how against it I am. Uh, I live in the U.S., and our news is just rife with made-up or fake stories, and I will spend the rest of my life railing against that. So I promise everyone on this channel that subscribes, I will never fake a video. I won't do it. Um, I think that it's one of the high crimes of our time, uh, the amount of disinformation and fakery that goes on. So it ain't going to happen here. What you see is what I filmed, and I swear to the Lord above, that's the truth. Um, people have asked me what that little symbol is on my opening and closing slides with the C followed by the lines. It's a representation of my telescope. The letter C represents crow, and also that you see through a telescope. The number of lines shows the aperture. Uh, it's an 8-inch aperture. Um, and lastly, um, I want to underscore just the moon is not what you think it is. Um, I can't tell you 100% what it is, but I believe that it's man-made or alien-made. Um, I don't believe it's just a rock in space. Um, what I've seen has totally changed my view of what's above us. And I urge everyone, you know, if you've got a camera or scope, go out and take a look. And you'll just start to understand... Um, it's not what we've been told, and to underscore this, we were told that the moon is grayscale, black and white. Um, this isn't true. I've proved it with my videos to some degree, but there's plenty of footage out there that shows the moon has all kinds of color. Um, Mars. Mars is another great example. We were told that it's all red, the sky is red. It's not. The sky is blue on Mars, and there's damn good evidence that there's water there. And yet us commoners are not allowed this information. And this is part of the deception or the omission of information that I rail against. And one of the reasons I'm making this channel to, to try to show real observations. At any rate, uh, I want to thank again my new subscribers. I truly appreciate your sponsorship. And uh, I'll have a new UFO clip up before too long. Thanks.